Hi, this is Joe Herman. Last week in New York, after much anticipation, HP rolled out their fleet of new ZBook mobile workstations to an assembled audience of journalists and industry analysts at their global workstations event on the west side of Manhattan. Post-production professionals know why HP is the world's leading manufacturer of workstations since they consistently push the boundaries of what's possible with their tower and mobile workstation designs. HP workstations offer among the highest levels of performance in the industry, often with surprisingly attractive price tags, performance that usually leaves competitors like Apple and Dell far behind. As executives from HP's workstation division began to describe the new machines to us at the announcement, it was clear that they were about to introduce something special. Though they gave mention of the recently introduced Z240 workstation, which I made a video about, which I'll include a link to in the description below. This time, however, the rollout was not about big iron workstation towers and desktops, but new mobile workstations. Though several products related to desktop workstations were also introduced, which we'll also discuss in this video. The new mobile workstations are not just refreshed versions of previous models. They've been completely redesigned and not only offer unparalleled power in a mobile unit, with the latest technological innovations as well. In the case of the HP ZBook Studio, a brand new mobile workstation which HP is calling the first quad-core Ultrabook, Ultrabook meaning ultra-slim design, ultra-portability, and ultra-high battery life, HP has introduced a machine that could very well revolutionize the market and is their thinnest and lightest full-performance portable machine to date. The ZBook Studio starts at just 4.4 pounds, with a thickness of only 18 millimeters. My last portable workstation was around double that, much less powerful, and was a real drag to lug around. Suddenly, airline flights will become a lot easier for those who want to do serious work on the road. In addition to being extremely thin and light, the ZBook Studio features not only Intel Core processors, but Intel's industrial strength Xeon processors, which is the first time I have heard of them being put in a laptop. Another thing I really like is the fact that you can put dual HP Z Turbo Drive G2s for a total of 2 terabytes of storage in the machine. For those of you who aren't familiar with HP's Turbo Drive technology, it's basically solid state storage that goes right into the PCIe bus, delivering blazing performance levels much faster than SSDs. If you need more disk space to work with, you can connect external storage to the two built in Thunderbolt 3 ports. Thunderbolt 3 was introduced in June and offers incredibly fast transfer speeds of 40 gigabits per second. It wasn't all that long ago that I gushed about Thunderbolt 2's speed of 20 gigabits per second, which was double the speed of the original Thunderbolt's 10 gigabits per second. Naturally, with a speed of 40 gigabits per second, Thunderbolt 3 is great for external storage as well as connecting external video cards for GPU 3D rendering, a technique that has in the past year or so become a popular alternative to brute force CPU rendering. One Thunderbolt port can also support two 4K displays and according to Intel's website can transfer a 4K movie in 30 seconds. Even with compression, that is very fast. The ZBook Studio also allows for a hefty 32 gigabytes of ECC memory as well as powerful new NVIDIA GPU options such as the NVIDIA Quadra M1000M 2 gigabyte GDDR5. You can also opt for integrated Intel HD graphics, though it's not such an attractive option for graphics pros. In addition to these features, the ZBook Studio also offers an optional award-winning HP Dream Color UHD or FHD display, which is available as a touch display. Finally, the ZBook Studio also includes dual cooling fans. The ZBook Studio will be available in December 2015 starting at $1,699. Besides the ZBook Studio, HP also introduced three more ZBook mobile workstation models which contain the latest innovations in GPUs, CPUs, and displays, but are also dramatically thinner and lighter than their predecessors. The HP ZBook 15U is a workstation ultrabook and is a nice combination of mobility and affordability. This low-cost compact machine can be configured with up to 32 gigabytes of RAM, 
AMD Fire Pro Professional Graphics with a 2 GB frame buffer, an HP Z Turbo Drive G2, 1.5 TB of total storage, and an FHD touch display, 1920 by 1080 pixels. The ZBook 15U is planned for availability in January starting at $1,099. The HP ZBook 15 is the next generation of the world's top selling mobile workstation according to IDC Worldwide Workstation Tracker for Q2 2015. HP has redesigned the ZBook 15 inside and out and the result is that it is 27% thinner and 7% lighter than the previous generation. In addition, the ZBook 15 boasts an impressive 27% increase in battery life over the previous generation. The ZBook 15's got a 15.6 inch diagonal display and can be configured with Intel Core or Xeon processors, as well as an impressive 64 gigabytes of ECC memory, two one terabyte HP Z Turbo Drive G2s for a total of three terabytes of storage, two Thunderbolt 3 ports, and an optional HP DreamColor UHD or FHD touch displays. Pricing is not yet available on the HP ZBook 15. The HP ZBook 17 represents the utmost in power and performance in HP ZBook line. The latest incarnation of this 17.3 inch powerhouse features a whopping 67% increase in battery life. It's also 11% lighter than its predecessor. You can configure this machine with Intel Core or Xeon processors, up to 64 gigabytes of ECC memory, two one terabyte HP Z Turbo Drive G2s for a total of four terabytes of storage, two Thunderbolt 3 ports, and an optional DreamColor UHD or FHD touch display. Something that sets the HP ZBook 17 apart from its siblings is its ability to support an NVIDIA M5000M Quadro graphics card with an 8GB frame buffer. That's serious graphics performance for a mobile workstation. Pricing for the HP ZBook 17 is not yet available. All the ZBooks, including the ZBook Studio, ZBook 15, and 17, Feature new NVIDIA Quadro Professional Graphics, which provide nearly two times the performance of previous generation graphics. At the Global Workstation launch event in New York, HP explained to us how their new workstations undergo strict tests by independent third parties, such as MIL STD 810G, a rugged United States military standard that tests environmental conditions such as pressure, temperature, shock, moisture, dust, atmosphere, humidity, vibration, and others, and includes a 30-inch drop test performed 36 times. All in all, there are over 15 grueling tests in this standard. All HP ZBooks also come preloaded with HP Remote Graphics software, a useful application that allows for effective remote collaboration, especially handy for graphics applications. With it, you can harness the raw power of advanced graphics workstations over a network. ZBooks also come with HP's Performance Advisor, software that gives you all sorts of insight into the internal components and performance of your machine for more reliable and fast performance. Also introduced at the Global Workstation event was the new ZBook Dock with Thunderbolt 3. This new mobile workstation dock allows users to link up to 10 devices at once through ports that include Thunderbolt 3, which supports DisplayPort 1.2, USB 3.1 Gen 2 and PCIe, as well as four USB 3.0 ports, RJ45, VGA, combo audio, and two additional display ports. A useful thing to have around. While the big news at HP's event was mainly about the new ZBooks, there were some other interesting product announcements for their desktop and tower workstations. The HP Z Turbo Drive Quad Pro combines up to four super-fast HP Z Turbo Drive G2 modules onto one PCIe x16 card and can support up to two terabytes. It delivers sequential performance of up to, wait, you might want to sit down for this one, nine gigabytes per second. That is basically 16 times faster than a standard SSD drive. 
an unprecedented level of performance that is perfect for today's high-resolution workflows of 4K and beyond. The HP Z Turbo Drive Quad Pro can be used with HP Z440, Z640, and Z840 workstations. A card with four 256GB modules will cost $1,376. HP also introduced the new Z Cooler, an ultra quiet cooling solution designed to reduce system noise in HP Z workstations, which is perceived as being 40% quieter to the human ear compared to previous generations. That's important not only because it cuts down on distracting noise, but it's a necessity for sound studios and music producers who need absolute silence during recording. The HP Z Cooler works with the HP Z440 and Z840 workstations. It's available now for a price of $120. On the display side, HP also introduced the HP Z22N and the HP Z23N narrow bezel IPS displays. They've got 178 degree viewing angle IPS technology, and the color gamut is calibrated to 95 and 96% sRGB for optimal color quality. The HP Z22N and Z23N are available now and priced at $209 and $229 respectively. In conclusion, HP's new ZBooks are perfect for filmmakers, post-production professionals, video editors, music producers, and creative artists of all kinds who need serious mobile power. 3D animators, visual effects artists, and colorists have long recognized the power of HP workstations. They're currently used in top studios like DreamWorks Animation and many others on countless blockbuster movies. Video editors and music producers who may have traditionally used Apple MacBooks have also recently come on board, recognizing the superior performance HP offers in both their tower and mobile workstation designs. This is Joe Herman. Thanks for watching.